For six years now, the dead have walked the earth. But I've never seen anything like this. Hi, my name's Jake, and I've had a really bad day. It all started last night, when I finally found the man I was tracking. What was left of him, anyway. Thing is, when they're alone, they're really not that much of a threat. But, in a group, you run. All I've seen in the last year are the dead, and it's getting old. When things were clear, try to get some rest. The thing is, they never sleep. It's like a game of cat and mouse. If the cat was blind, deaf, and dumb, and dead. I decided to take the high road. They're not built for climbing. The strange thing is, they weren't chasing me. And that's something that never happens. So, naturally, I was curious. Against my better judgment, I sat and watched from the trees. It was strange. These things don't act like this. And they sure as hell don't use cups. I should have ran back the way I came. But, I pushed on. I followed the sound of a motor into a town. Thought it was a sign of life. It was unreal. And the stench of that one baking in the sun. And I had a feeling the other one didn't really know how to drive. It was kind of entertaining. <laughs> it was kind of funny. Things just kept getting stranger from there. The deeper I went, the weirder it got. Did they think they were still alive? A few houses down, I heard the sound of a man's voice. So I went up to look through the window. Yes, time makes fools of us all. And what I saw? So head on down to Dr. Brain's clinic. Didn't Twice make the much sense. Of the average zombie and patent pending Zombies don't make commercials. And, and talk about a couch potato. Dr. Brain's procedures are over with quick as a whip. And they're so simple, But he the really seemed to like what he was watching. But wait, you say. How much could such a procedure cost? I was starting to wonder if I was losing my mind. None of this made any sense. Then sure enough, one walked right past me. Didn't even blink an eye. But then, the game changed. And this one, I knew how to play. I was finally back on my terms. Except, I got sloppy. One mistake can be the end of you out here. And before you knew it, I was surrounded. They came from everywhere. This was bad. My brain buster was stuck, so I did what I always do. I ran. They chased me, like always. But now, I wasn't moving so good. But god damn it, they're gonna have to work for their meal. Thought I was screwed. But then, he came along. Close. Here, we can't 
can't have you dying of thirst. Thanks, man. Come, have a seat. You don't know how good it is to see you. Got a little tea. You don't know how good it is to see you, Charlie. You always wear such a thirsty one. My name's not. Thirsty Charlie! Thirsty, thirsty Charlie! There was something in that water. You see, Charlie? I am the town, and the town is me. Perfect order. Isn't it beautiful? Yes, perfect order and a job for everyone. And it's all done with one little trick. And it's all done with social media. You see, Charlie? People will believe anything as long as it's on the internet. Let's see what happens when I say a new study has confirmed dirt is as nutritious as brains. Ha! Ah, look over there! I told you they believe it! They'll eat anything! Why, Charlie, they'll do anything I tell them to. <laughs> oh, it's a, some special entertainment, Charlie! Look! They are so busy looking at what I told them! They don't even know where they're going! My old fork works every time, but, uh... Don't let me tell you how it is. Let's sing about it. Sit back, open your ears, and I'll blow your mind! <laughs> can't have a musical number without dancers! If you want to build a society, a town of happy folk and mayor like me, there's no need for careful thought out policy. All you need some fancy technology. why you're not Charlie. And now our guest is bored. Six weeks of rehearsal. Down the drain. Wakey, wakey, Charlie. <laughs> it's time for us to play a little game. Now, you'll notice you're tied up pretty tightly. But off to your left. There's a gun! The thing is, that gun would be really handy to help you escape. But if you touch it, I want to start the countdown timer. Well, I already started the countdown timer. Can you get free in time? Oh. <laughs> Wait, did I... Did I tie the rope? Did I... Why didn't I put a camera in that room? Oh, the hell with it. I'm just going to hit the button. Let's end this show with a bang! I just wanted to get out of there. But when I got out, things got bad. Broken and bloodied.